So as we're getting back into Call of Dragons, I figured it's time that we do some exploration because this is something that I have neglected for so long inside of the game. I don't love doing it. It's tedious, it takes time. And now in season two, we have so many caves to explore and things to find and resources that are free to get. That just becomes a lot. I would love a boop, collect all button, wouldn't you? But that is not the case inside of the game. So today we are going to be searching, hunting, finding, and getting ourselves the resources that we need so we can finally make our way up City Hall. Hall of Order, all 25. That's the journey, that's the grind, that's the focus. And we only have two buildings to upgrade before we get there, which is exciting. Hope you're all doing well today. And I hope that you guys have collected all of your resources as well. My primary focus here in doing the hunt is collecting any speed ups, any resources, any mages that we can find. Because as you know, with my account, my primary focus is mages. I want to have a Lilia Velen strong tier four mage march, which will eventually be a strong tier five mage march. From there, my goal is going to be working on either celestials or archers, but we are far from there yet. So being a light spender inside of the game at this point in time, as things have changed, the whole outlook on the game has changed and it brings a different perspective and one that many of you probably share with me. I know that everyone is not a big spender. Me personally, I bought packs and I bought the dailies for a while, but now we're going a more free to play route. So as I take myself around and aimlessly go after these resources that are very important, very much needed, some may even say essential, I wanna ask you, now that we are back in Call of Dragons, we are here enjoying it together again. What are a few topics that you would like to see me talk about? You've been kind of echo list for content for about a month now. We put out some guides, hero guides, new player guides. We did a whole bunch of stuff on war as well. What are some things that you, the viewer, whether you're someone from the blood family that's been watching for a while, or whether you're someone that is a brand new player who downloaded the game today, what are some things that you would like to see me cover on the channel? Because honestly, that's where I'd like to start. I wanna be here to bring you what you wanna see. Now, Blood Family, bring me back. I'm ready to go. I'm ready to dive back in. And I can't dive into behemoths in war unless I'm in a clan or an alliance, I should say, that actually fights behemoths and engages in war. So looking forward to all of that. So caves, for example. It was suggested to me in the comment section of a previous video that caves are so important. The resources that we can gain from them are so plentiful that you should record your cave as everything's swapping so that you can actually follow the proper card to get the biggest rewards. I think it's cheating the system, which is fine. I just personally don't take caves that seriously where I would actually record it, watch it back in slow motion and then make my choice. It seems a tad bit uh, excessive, but let me know. Are you someone that actually does that? Because I know that some people must do it, but it's not going to be me. I just personally don't have that kind of patience, although I do like those resources quite a bit. So the goal here is probably by the end of the week or so, I hope to uh, have all of the caves explored, all of the shipments that have been delivered to be picked up. And I want to see how many resources I can actually gain from it. Now, I'm not keeping track. We don't have a tally. We don't have a counter. No, we just want to make sure that we have all the resources we need because getting the upgrade for the prerequisites for City Hall or Hall of Order 25 are steep. Yeah, I got a little bored with the caves. We're, we're just cleaning up here, making the room look uh, a little nice. And yeah. We try and keep a little weights around so throughout the day as we sit here and game, we can move a little bit, keep ourselves fit, healthy. By the way, I am on a new healthy eating kick and it's kind of crazy. Do you, do you wanna hear about it? No? 
All right, fine. Now I know that you guys actually want to hear about it. So what I'm doing is I'm intermittent fasting, which I've been doing for a year, but now I boosted it up to the next level. So now I fast all day and I have one meal per day that is zero complex carbs, nothing man-made. So my dinners, which is the only meal that I'm eating is meat, steak, chicken, fish, shellfish, any kind of meat, not breaded, with vegetables, if I wanna throw fruit in there, which you really don't typically throw fruit in with a dinner type thing, but I can. Um, and that's it, no grains, so I'm not having like rice or anything like that with it. Instead, I'm having like vegetables with meat. It's been okay, it's been okay. Uh, I get hungry throughout the day, which I just drink coffee throughout. And then when six or seven o'clock at night comes, I eat a lot. And you could eat a lot of the meats, a lot of the vegetables, really whatever you want, fill yourself up because you gotta go another 24 hours until you eat again. Now, I will sometimes an hour or two later snack on some almonds or maybe some cashews and maybe have another coffee or a seltzer, but it's been real. I'm trying to get back my, my 20s bod, but I'm a dad now. I don't want the dad bod, so we're, we're on a mission. So as my fingers are getting tired and we're moving forward and kind of ending our collecting session for the day, I'm gonna remind you guys that I wanna know what topics you wanna see me discussing next. What's something inside of Call of Dragons that you don't quite understand? What's something in Call of Dragons that you maybe are having a little bit of a feud with someone about? Something that you want to learn about? Or maybe there's disagreements that you need settled. I'm here, I can do that. And I'm looking forward to it. We're gonna be putting out videos three days a week, supplemented with short content of things that you may have missed. I'm looking forward to it. I'm looking forward to being back with all of you. So thank you so much. If you wanna continue your journey with me, remember to subscribe to the channel and ring the bell for regular Call of Dragons videos. It'll be good.